You want it to be one way. What? You want it to be one way. Man, I don't know. You want know it to you... be one Man, way. Man, stop! Stop saying that. But it's the other way. Fuck your guns, fuck your gun sounds, fuck your crew, fuck you, nigga. Oh, y'all motherfuckers thought y'all was gonna have a big stage battle without Big T? I already know what you gonna say. I ain't doing this. I'm from Pontiac. You've made so many moves. I'm in a movie. And why the fuck we battling then if you so popular and so famous, nigga? What up? You're coming to my house. Don't you ever bring scared business to me. You're looking at the toughest rascal Jamaican in the United States of America. I run shit. I kill for nothing. Y'all thought I was gone? Okay. RBE, ARP, y'all got me. Shut the fuck up, nigga. August 18th, Ill Will vs. Big T. Tuna, whatever the fuck, nigga. Yak Town, nigga. We gonna play a little game called Y'all Must Have Forgot August 18th. And we gonna start with Ill Will. Big T, RBE, first debut, Big Tuna. My shit ready when I get there. Now first round, I gave him a straight right. Second, I'ma drop a hook on dog. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy. That mean if this site pull, I bet the first five book on God. <laughs> What's up? I've been one of the most consistent battle rappers of this era. This era. Bars. The highest level of lyricism. Aggression. Performance. I show up every time. No choke. No stumble. I give it my all. I go in there and I, and I peel skin off these niggas, right? So what y'all do? How, how, how did y'all reward me for that? Y'all gave me a motherfucker who was once champion. If he dies, he dies. It disappoints me that he doesn't see all the variables which make certain people God tier. You know what I mean? He just thinks it's because he has better punchlines. Y'all got a nigga who's going for the champion of the year versus a nigga who was the champion. So Pat said catch Jimmy Miles just one good time. Just one good time, and then choke slams the out of that man. Mr. Nova Scotia, Mr. Jokes, Mr. Angles, a little bit of rapping skill. Straight off rip, that punk the white boy shit, I ain't in the mood for it. You push me, I swing like a saloon door. When force, if I get jumped, Will and Jada stomping off at the boo store. In another couple seconds, I come back swinging with a two-four. Oh. Hey, hey, New York! And this is the guy that can rap with me? That's, that's what y'all did? I was reading an article about you. It said, Chilla Jones, top pick. And I can't even tell you the rest cause I stopped in. I mock me. Scream up on him cause his people wildin' out. Then plug in the back of his head like Neo dialing out. Help me. I don't know what to say. I'm 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 envious of him. Like I know I made that video of the angry spider thing, making fun of him for ah, but like I wish. I wish I could have a standing battle rap climax after one of my own lines. I already know what time it is, man. I am back on the motherfucking platform. Brick by brick and watch what the fuck happened. And I get it. 
Now that I'm a father, like I see my son sometimes when I'm not inspired, I just pick him up and he's like, gives me this like burst of energy, you know what I mean? And then I walk out and I'm motivated. This guy gets to do that 10 times. He has 10 kids. He walks out the door. Okay, guys, have a good one. that I never met this nigga a day in my life. You understand me? I like the fact that I never had no kind of conversation with this nigga on the phone, in person, nothing. Because now I get to just go in. I don't know you. Something wrong? Something wrong? Yeah. It's just too bad you don't know what it is. Yeah, yeah, you already know who it is. It's your boy, Lil Loaded, Baby Lux, Diet Lux, Beloved 2.5, and I'm in the building. Letting you know I'll be in the building at Club Drum August 18th. I'm going against the brother of, uh, um, what's his name? Um, uh, he, hold on, let me get it together. Let me get it together. He was born in Harlem Hospital in 1935. He was born in Harlem Hospital in 1935. Oh, yeah, it's your boy, Swave Seven. Oh, yeah, it's gonna be mean, early, handsome. You already know what it is. It's your boy, Two Pistol Yosemite Sam. I put two inside you, the fastest way around Los Angeles is an Uber driver. How dare you talk for that? I should stomp you out up and down MLK. And while you hurt, make you eat dirt from Big L Gray. When I hear Sway say that, I'm like, perfect, nigga, because I don't, I don't know you neither, nigga. Back down on two different totally different down, and he's a rapidly rapping ass nigga. I'm not trying to outwrap him. What I'm gonna do though is paint a very clear picture of who he is to y'all. You already know what it is, your boy Young B Dot, West Sider. I'll be in the building August 18th versus the legend, Swave Sever, the gatekeeper. You here for some rain, Danny? We need to know where your grandmama stay. Get out the car if I snatch you out that motherfucker. I'm the lady, the 40 clap and a rolling back like a yoga mat. Now I'm gonna stay. Let's be honest. <laughs> You already know what it is. We're gonna turn up. Make sure y'all get your tickets, pay-per-view purchases, whatever y'all gotta do. I'm coming to New York for the first time, man. Shout out to ARP for bringing me through. It's gonna be lovely, man. Let's get it. I'm a killer. Huh? I wanna see niggas ride in their grave pit. Wordplay. Nigga, my words ain't meant to be played with. <laughs> Disappointed in you, Kenneth. That's me. This is you. As a fat man, I feel you've abandoned us. You're on the skinny side now. As a rapper, you're on the whack side now. I don't like it. August 18th. You know, you're, you're funny. <laughs> you mean, so? man, let me understand this, because I don't, you know, maybe it's me, I'm a little fucked up, maybe. But I'm funny how? I mean, funny like I'm a clown, I amuse you. I make you laugh. I'm here to fucking amuse you. Big K vs. Iron Solomon, August 18th. Rare Breeze, Rare Breed Entertainment, New York City. Y'all know what the fuck is up. Y'all know how I'm coming. You know what I come to do. Check it out. Iron Solomon, look alive, squirt. Hey. I got somebody with me too. Ooh. 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 You know what happened when these come out. Last time these came out. I've been looking for you, Zimmerman. Oh, oh, oh. Fuck out of here. Yo, you gonna make me knock you out. How your punk ass ran away from Battle Rap for about five years, didn't you? He made it rain all over your pussy ass, didn't he? God show mighty. Hey, check, hey, check it out, sir. We got some things to talk about, huh? Let me put these, let me put these away right there. Hanukkah's trash. Fuck dreidels. Huh? Potato pancakes are garbage. Matzo ball soup is terrible. You could never beat me at nothing, sir. Hopefully by the time this footage gets in the hands of ARP, you allow to promote our battle. 
you know how y'all battle rappers do. Y'all be out here signing y'all motherfucking life away, the leagues and shit, you know? But we'll, we'll talk about it, man. You know how you, even, even a so-called legend like yourself bends over and takes it up the motherfucking ass every now and then, <laughs> you know? But that's how y'all do, man. Not the dog. It could never be me. It could never be me, all right? And I've been listening to the fans out here, you know? I listen to all the feedback, and I, I'm aware that, you know, y'all feel like, uh... I've been out here winning every battle 3-0, and I agree. I agree. This is no different. This is no different. Iron Solomon, I'm gonna kick your motherfucking ass. Look alive, squirt. I sound, I fire, got a dollar for the lotto, not a bitch nigga Got a knife for a hollow for a snitch nigga You a hater from a player, suck a dick nigga I don't spend time or money or bitch nigga You niggas is in trouble August 18th Nigga, I want all the smoke nigga Oh yeah Don't let an industry rapper fuck you up, right? <laughs> yeah, it's official I see y'all August 18th, you heard? It's only right. Gave me less than a month to prepare for you after I already had my shit ready for daylight. Try to handicap a nigga, huh? Ah, ah, ah. My nigga. I got you. Red Breed. Right. Oh, it's a Harlem night for real. Fans, don't be upset. Just call it a, a act of God. Look, this jock playing with hip hop. I'm in flip flop shooting at a snitch block. Yeah. Every morning, nigga moving by the bird of better. I send shooters to hit shooters, nigga, come and get us. Bring your best shit, nigga. Let's make this good. And all you other niggas on the car, this don't exclude you either. Bird, Mook, B Dot. Oh, you niggas better bring your shit. Cause I'm looking to have performance of the night. August 18th, you heard? The wolf is in the building. Now you niggas step your game up. Get out of here. RBE, y'all gotta get these cameras to fuck up out my house. Come on. Watch your step. Watch your step. It was nice talking to y'all. I got shit to do. I got money to make. Verb, or, verb and Mook too, right? I thought that was interesting that Mook has now decided to battle again and chose Verb. I still think Verb, when he gets in his bag, is like, as a writer, I know what he is capable of doing. Yeah. First off, I don't twerk in my rhymes. I give you good raps, and I don't never flirt with the dimes. I'm into hood rats, lyrical Picasso. I give you the vivid pictures when you mix the ignorance with the brilliance. Oh, what a nigga. August 18th, RBE, A Bird vs. Murder Mook. For all y'all that's betting on Murder Mook, I'm going to ask you, how do you bet on a guy that's seen no pressure? This man got three battles in 10 years, and he hasn't brought you motherfuckers one cold show. None of his battles are high viewed. He's never been touched, never had no pressure on him. Verb has 50 four battles 
I've only lost clear about nine battles. I'm on the road 95% of the time. All the kings that y'all like, I've cracked them. But you bet your money with this nigga over here. Y'all the fools. It ain't strange if I hit that angel dust, get my anger upturned. Juggernaut, his frame get crushed. Shots point blank range, bang, he fucked his soul fly and I'm still fired. Even his guardian angels duck. Oh. I'm going to put you through some shit you've never been through. I'm going to put you through the blender, homeboy. You have not had your jaw tested. We don't know who, how can y'all give a nigga the number one nigga spot if he's never been touched? He's never been tested. We don't know how dangerous this man is. How do you know how dangerous he is? How do you know how great he is? You know what make a great, a great? A great is when he can fight back. A great is when a nigga can get on stage with all the odds against him and get busy. That's a great. Y'all are clapping for a nigga that has never been touched. Has not gave y'all a cold show yet. You niggas don't even remember nothing this man says. Y'all don't remember shit. Y'all seen me. See, one thing about being great is a curse. Being great is a curse. When LeBron go get 30 and 10 all season long, we overlook the shit. Let Tristan Thompson do it, and we're gonna clap. That's all it is, I've been great too long. So this is my fault for being great, motherfuckers. This is my problem. Y'all, this ain't y'all fault, this is my fault. Cause I've been great, cause I done set the standards so high. Cause I done been magical too many motherfucking times all over the world. I don't even get home games no more. This man, now keep in mind what y'all saying. Keep in mind, keep all this same energy. All you niggas, listen, you bloggers and camera niggas, don't say shit to me when it's over. Don't ask me for a motherfucking interview. Cause guess what, I'm watching everything. I'm watching the whole floor. It's the same situation with Loaded Lux. When y'all saw Loaded Lux at first, guess what he was? A god, he was so great. But the more that nigga kept fighting, the more you start seeing that he wasn't that good as what the fuck you thought. And you motherfuckers know it. Y'all know it. If Mook was in Des Moines, Iowa, what would he be? Nothing. Look, I ain't in a position, I'm from St. Louis homeboy, which is, you know, we live in a show me state. You're gonna have to show me that you cold, bro. You're gonna have to show me, cause I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm, I'm on your head, boy. I'm on your head, no breathing. Niggas all worried about like, oh, he's gonna be going so long. I don't give a fuck how long this man go. I'm gonna crack him. I'm gonna crack him. Now understand, he's the first. That's all he is, but he has not shown you motherfuckers that he's cold. I stood in front of every one of y'all favorite rappers. Every one of them niggas. I stood in front of every one of these niggas. Everybody that y'all love, I sink them. Whatever happened. Now keep in mind, I only got about nine clear losses and I battle in every league. I go to any city. I get out the plane by myself. By myself. Mook has seen no pressure. I seen all the pressure you can throw at me. And you gonna bet on them? Get that money down. Boy, I swear to God, August 18th can't, can't. Oh God, oh shit. I ain't even fucking hoes right now. And that's crazy for me. For y'all, it's normal. I ain't even fucking hoes, I'm just chilling. Cause I'm focused on gunning this man down. Watch me work. August 18th. Suck my dick. I never liked you anyway, pretty motherfucker. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. Alright. Mm. Fuck, I'm sitting here watching the game. Hey, yo. Take this for me. Let me pause the game. Hey, 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 hold on. Here, take the remote. Oh, tell um. Tell Adam Silva I said pause the game. I don't take one person lighter than the other, ever. I don't care who it is. I want to, I want, I always want to feel threatened in any kind of a way I drag the motivation from. So I need to feel threatened first. Once I'm threatened, which I do right now, it don't matter what kind of threat I feel it is, or where it comes from, that that differs. A fear of loss of anything, you understand? It don't gotta be a loss from a battle, it could be loss of anything. Once I feel like you could take something from me, you're not doing that. I'm not letting nobody take nothing from me because I built what I built with this. So all of that, I, I stay the same, very consistent with mindset thought. I don't, I, I don't be like, oh, this person this way, I'm gonna take him lightly. I'm gonna take him lighter than the other person. Like I've heard people say, yo, you know, people took me lightly, that's why I beat them. Like if there's anybody you shouldn't be taking lightly, it should be me. Like, you know what I mean? Like you can't, it, that's just, you just make them look bad. Like, you know, when I'd say Floyd, 
you know, niggas be like, yo, he didn't have his best fight against Floyd. Like, how the fuck do you not have your best fight against the greatest boxer ever? You know what I mean? No, he just make you not be able to hit him. He make you, he does these things. That's, he, that's what he knows how to do. That's what he does really well. And that's me. You know what I mean? I was, I didn't, I, you know what I mean? I'm like, damn, ARP. You know what I mean? I, shout out to ARP. I, I really want to give ARP a shot, shout out though. Big one, man, because, you know, aside from doing great business, man, you know, he, he has a, I like his um, ambition, man. He got a lot of ambition, man. ARP, and he's really, you know, he's stand up from what, from what he's done. He's stand up. You know, so I want a big shout out for that. If there is something with the stages and RB and, you know, the spot that, that I've seen, the people that came, that I was there when I went there last time, you know, I, they, it looks like they, they listen to you. They really listen more. Like, you know, that's one thing I guess about the smack and them, like smack niggas, they just, they want to boo you. You know what I mean? That's, that's like a new thing, I think, right? They doing, like, they just like come and like, we gonna boo this nigga today. And then we, you know what I mean? They, like you slip, you do one thing as you hear like, boo, niggas be like, damn. Yeah, like, but even that though, it's like, 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 damn, like you can't even say one thing that they don't like. Like they just want to boo. It's like if we, if they don't get to boo you, they just like. I'm watching them boo mad people. You know what I mean? I'm like, damn, son, like, damn. I mean, I need every. Well, first of all, y'all better hurry up and get y'all. I don't think y'all gonna be able to get to the building. That's just one. It's not. It's not gonna hold enough people. So. They gotta come, they gotta get watch pay-per-view. Watch the pay-per-view, cause it's gonna be hard to get there. If you could get a ticket, hard to get a ticket. Funk Monster Flex Night, hard to get a ticket. But if you could get one, I recommend you do. But, you know, they gonna expect, what they gonna expect from me is just pain, man. It's gonna be pain. I'm ready to, like, I could battle Verb right now. Like, right now. Oh my daughter. Drop dead. We could battle right now. Like, I, that's how thirsty I am to beat him. Like, I need to beat him for another purpose that nobody knows. Not just the fuck, like, it's a nobody knows this purpose that I need to beat him for. And when I found that, that's when I felt comfortable with telling ARP, yeah, I'll do it. Because when I found that, like this shit, I'm going to destroy a verb, man. I'm gonna beat a verb so fucking bad that it's no. I'm. I'm gonna beat him bad, man. Bad, bad. Like he is. He gonna understand what it's like to to feel this. Like people always like like shout out to Lux, man, because that's my brother. But like after when Lux, you gotta understand that when niggas battle me, after they say they lost. When the last time you heard niggas say they lost? Niggas battle me. Iron Solomon said I lost. The battle wasn't even over. Niggas said, yo, I lost, man. I got I lost. Lux after that, yo, shh. I lost. You got the niggas say they lost when they beat me, man. They can't, it's no up for nah, niggas say they lost. And with with Lux and my bro, like, it's different, man. When you right there, it's so different. He's so different. It ain't like you believe when you watch it, man. It's not. When you in there and you looking and you fur, boy. I'm telling you, August 18th. Y'all need to be in that building, man. Murder Move vs. Averb. RBE. Get that pay-per-view. It's gonna be a long fucking night for Averb. I'ma beat the shit out of Averb. Verb, you gonna die bad. And I hope it's gonna be on World Star too, so they can just keep reliving your death. That's it. Also with us is the one and only Murder Mook, the king of battle rap. He's a video gaming enthusiast. And if you have any doubts at all that Murder Mook is the king of battle rap, you can tune into his pay-per-view because the live thing is sold out yeah. August 18th, Rare Breed Entertainment. Yes. Link on your Instagram, Murder yes. Mook Easy. Yes, I mean, hello. Is he fucking